the SES Massive and Crew. This video is about the a quick review on the DT 990s. These are the Bayer Dynamic headphones. Um, these are very good headphones for studio recording. Uh, I wouldn't recommend them uh, for DJing because uh, of the size of the headphones are quite big um, but uh, probably for general listening and um, I would say definitely from you know doing mix downs what I like most about these headphones is they've got a very very good bass response um, so in the studio you know you can hear the bottom end quite nicely as compared to my AKGs um, which I have here which only give you kind of like a more of a Yamaha NS10 kind of sound. Um, it's great, um, but I prefer something that I can get into because these headphones have really, really good bass on them. And when I'm working on tunes, I like to hear bass and the subs and stuff in the productions, which is very important for me. So for these, these ones win over those uh, for me anytime. Um, yeah, I just wanted to say that that's a good pair of headphones for the studio so check those out i've also got other headphone reviews um so subscribe to my channel uh, if you want to hear more also for djing these are great headphones for djing uh, these are the sennheiser and they are the hd 25 c2s and this is the 70 ohm version these are very very good headphones you can hear them really nice in a club um, you could also use these for your productions, I guess, but uh, what you'll find is they're quite a tight fit if you put them on your ears. And because the cups are so small, after a while, um, not when you're DJing, but because you know you only have them on one ear. But what I found after after a time, if you're using these as general headphones, they tend to kind of like feel a bit uncomfortable in your ears after a while because it's like you know it feels you get kind of not ear fatigue, but but like sore ears from it. So I wouldn't recommend these for long periods of listening. Um, they got this, the split, um, you know, brackets at the top. And also, from what I remember about some of these headphones is a lot of these parts are replaceable if they go wrong. Um, yeah, so if you found this video useful, uh, please subscribe. I'm going to be doing a lot more equipment reviews over time. Uh, take it. God bless. Peace. And there you have it, Everyday Jungler Style Bass